The origins in the survey is part of our control your privacy campaign. And we started doing this back in 2014. The aim of the campaign was to raise awareness um, between, among students using social media and the effects that it has on, on, on their privacy and so forth. Um, since then the campaign has grown and uh, every year we carry out the survey to see whether there are any trends to the results, to the behaviour of students and what it is that they do and so forth. So of the results this year, what are the trends that stood out the most for you? We've compared it now to the past five years and we've seen that um, students, as they get older, and we're talking about um, students from year 7s, year 9s and year 11s, as they get older they tend to be using more social media apps. Um, really popular social media apps, and this is a very interesting trend, is that um, well, at a young age they might start using your, your Facebooks, but as they, gra as they gradually get older they're moving away from Facebook and they're using more rich media apps such as WhatsApp, your Instagram and your Snapchat. And it is in there we see a very interesting behavioural trend, mainly because the way that I see it, as a student get older, they tend to have the latest mobiles and it's a quicker access, easier to share information. Mm -hmm. And these rich media apps are the ones that are being used now. There was also a result um, that said that I think 86% of students share information about others without their consent. This is quite worrying. Um, it is quite worrying. If you think about it, okay, the entire uh, campaign is to generate awareness in privacy. Now, one can put what, this generation, uh, this uh, generating of, of awareness is good for someone to protect their own privacy. But when you're sharing information without someone's consent, really you're giving away someone's privacy away. And that in itself is what becomes a concern. So we want them to be aware that it's not just protecting yourself, but to have consideration for others as well. And what advice would you give to students regarding social media? The reality is that students uh, nowadays, you know, they are the generation to use social media. It's a fantastic tool to actually use. And we're not there to tell, them, to tell them not to use it. What we want them to be is fully aware of the implications and and possible dangers in the future if they use things carelessly. If they put too much information out there that eventually if they wanted something to be kept private, it won't be kept private because what goes out there in the, in the internet, what goes out there in social media will most definitely stay out there for almost forever and be very hard to control. So just use it wisely.